United States Marine Fife and Drum Corps. For millennia, a silent revolution has been brewing, unseen by the naked eye, yet shaping the world around us. This is the story of biotechnology, a field as old as civilization itself. From the bread we eat to the medicines we rely on, biotechnology's fingerprints are everywhere. It's a testament to our ancestors' early experiments and a beacon of progress for the future. This journey of discovery and innovation is what we're about to embark on. Imagine a world without fluffy bread or the life-saving power of penicillin. These marvels are the fruits of biotechnology, harnessing the power of living organisms to develop groundbreaking solutions. Engineering crops and designing therapies, biotechnology drives human advancement. Its influence pervades our lives, often unnoticed. This essay will delve into the captivating history of biotechnology, exploring milestones and brilliant minds behind them. Get ready to uncover the fascinating narrative of biotechnology. Before we set off on our exploration, let's define the very essence of biotechnology. Simply put, it's the application of biological systems and organisms to develop or make products. This definition, however, barely scratches the surface of this vast and dynamic field. Biotechnology encompasses a spectrum of disciplines, from microbiology and genetics to chemical engineering and computer science. It's a melting pot of scientific endeavors, all converging towards a common goal, leveraging the power of nature for the betterment of humanity. The scope of biotechnology is as diverse as life itself. It empowers us to engineer microorganisms that churn out life-saving insulin, develop crops that can withstand harsh climates, and even edit genes with unprecedented precision. In essence, biotechnology provides us with the tools to understand, manipulate, and even enhance the building blocks of life. Its applications are virtually limitless, constantly evolving with our growing knowledge of the biological world. But biotechnology is more than just a collection of techniques and applications. It's a testament to human curiosity, our innate desire to unravel the mysteries of the natural world and our relentless pursuit of solutions to some of humanity's most pressing challenges. From combating diseases to ensuring food security for a growing population, biotechnology holds the key to a brighter and more sustainable future. Our exploration of biotechnology begins with its humble origins long before the term itself was coined. It's a journey that takes us back to the dawn of civilization, where our ancestors unknowingly laid the foundation for this transformative field. We'll uncover the ingenuity of ancient civilizations, their rudimentary yet effective practices of fermentation and agriculture, and how these early endeavors sowed the seeds for the biotechnology revolution we're witnessing today. From there, we'll trace the evolution of biotechnology through the ages, witnessing its growth and transformation alongside major historical periods. We'll delve into the Middle Ages, where alchemists and healers unknowingly paved the way for modern medicine and the Renaissance, a period of intellectual awakening that breathed new life into scientific exploration. Each step of the way will uncover the key discoveries, innovations and the brilliant minds that propelled biotechnology forward. Get ready to embark on an enthralling journey through time, witnessing the unfolding narrative of biotechnology. It's a story of human ingenuity, perseverance, and our unwavering quest to understand and harness the power of life itself. Prepare to be amazed by the long and winding road that has led us to the forefront of this scientific revolution, a revolution that continues to shape our world in profound and often unimaginable ways. Our journey into the origins of biotechnology begins amidst the cradle of civilization. Long before microscopes, our ancestors laid the foundation for biotechnology. They transitioned from nomadic societies to settled agricultural communities. This shift, driven by plant and animal domestication, marked humanity's partnership with nature. Early farmers selected seeds from the best plants, shaping crop genetics. Through observation, they unknowingly practiced early biotechnology. Selective breeding was a testament to human ingenuity. Animal domestication followed a similar path. Early herders bred animals for desirable traits, cows for more milk and horses for strength and endurance. 
These practices laid the groundwork for agriculture and biotechnology. While early farmers shaped the world above ground, another revolution brewed beneath the surface. Fermentation, ancient as civilization, transformed grapes, grains, and milk into wine, beer, bread, and cheese. This biological alchemy was likely a serendipitous discovery, harnessing wild yeasts to preserve food and enhance flavor. From the Nile to Mesopotamia, evidence of fermentation practices abounds with ancient breweries and dairy production. These early fermenters, pioneers in their own right, unknowingly manipulated microorganisms to create nourishing products. The art of fermentation extended far beyond mere sustenance. It became intertwined with ancient cultures, religions and social customs. Beer, in particular, held a special place in many societies, often revered as a sacred drink and used in religious ceremonies. The ancient Egyptians, for instance, were renowned for their brewing skills, developing sophisticated techniques for producing various types of beer, each with its unique flavor profile. Bread, another product of fermentation, also held immense cultural significance. In many cultures, bread symbolized nourishment, prosperity, and even life itself. The act of baking bread was often imbued with ritualistic elements passed down through generations of women who were the guardians of this ancient knowledge. These early bakers, kneading dough and tending to their sourdough starters, were unknowingly participating in a long lineage of biotechnology, their actions shaping the flavors and textures of a food that would grace tables for millennia to come. The skills of these ancient brewers and bakers were more than just culinary arts, they were forms of early biotechnology passed down through generations of careful observation, experimentation and adaptation. These artisans, though lacking a formal understanding of microbiology, were masters of their craft, manipulating microorganisms to produce foods and beverages that were not only delicious but also played integral roles in their cultures and societies. The legacy of early innovations in biotechnology extends beyond bread, cheese and wine. These practices laid the foundation for biology and chemistry. Domestication and fermentation were the first chapters in biotechnology. These early endeavors highlight our desire to partner with nature. The roots of modern biotechnology lie in ancient history. As Europe emerged from the Dark Ages, a renewed interest in knowledge, fueled by the rediscovery of classical texts, swept across the continent. This period, known as the Renaissance, witnessed a flourishing of art, science and philosophy, laying the groundwork for a new era of scientific exploration. Within this fertile intellectual landscape, the seeds of modern biotechnology began to sprout, often intertwined with the practices of alchemy and medicine. Alchemists, driven by a desire to transmute base metals into gold and discover the elixir of life, played an unwitting role in advancing the frontiers of early biotechnology. Their relentless experimentation with herbs, minerals and other natural substances, though often guided by mystical beliefs, led to the development of new techniques for distillation, extraction and purification. These techniques, refined over generations, would later prove invaluable in the development of pharmaceuticals and other biotechnological applications. Meanwhile, physicians, grappling with plagues and diseases that ravaged populations, sought solace in the healing power of nature. Herbal remedies, passed down through generations, formed the cornerstone of medical practice. Monasteries, with their meticulously kept gardens, became centers for cultivating medicinal plants, their knowledge of herbal remedies carefully documented and preserved. These early practitioners, though lacking a deep understanding of human physiology, recognized the potent biological activity of plants unknowingly laying the groundwork for the development of modern pharmaceuticals. The 15th century printing press revolutionized knowledge dissemination. Scientific texts and philosophical treatises became accessible, fostering inquiry and exchange. Renaissance universities nurtured minds that shaped biotechnology's future. 
Leonardo da Vinci's anatomical drawings provided unprecedented insights. His work exemplified the Renaissance spirit of scientific inquiry. Paracelsus challenged traditional medicine advocating for minerals and chemicals. He introduced dosage, laying the groundwork for pharmacology. Perhaps the most significant invention that propelled biotechnology forward was the microscope. Developed in the late 16th century, this revolutionary instrument opened a window into a previously invisible world, revealing the existence of microorganisms, bacteria, fungi and protozoa that had long eluded human perception. This discovery would have profound implications for medicine, agriculture and our understanding of life itself. Antony van Leeuwenhoek, a Dutch draper with a passion for lens making, is credited with making some of the most significant early observations using a single lens microscope. His meticulous observations of pond water, blood, and even his own dental plaque revealed a teeming microscopic world teeming with creatures he called animalcules. Leeuwenhoek's discoveries, though met with skepticism by some, challenged the prevailing notion of spontaneous generation, the idea that life could arise from non-living matter, the microscope also revolutionized the study of plant anatomy. English scientist Robert Hooke, using a compound microscope, observed the cellular structure of cork, coining the term cell to describe the tiny compartments he observed. Hooke's work, documented in his groundbreaking book Micrographia, laid the foundation for cell theory the cornerstone of modern biology, which states that all living organisms are composed of cells, the basic unit of life. From the Middle Ages to the Enlightenment, knowledge revival and universities set the stage for a scientific revolution. The invention of the microscope transformed biotechnology. Alchemists, physicians and early microscopists laid the groundwork. Their efforts led to the Industrial Revolution's fertile ground for biotechnology. New discoveries in chemistry, physics and biology converged. The stage was set for a new era of biotechnology. The Industrial Revolution transformed societies, driving innovation in biotechnology. Chemists turned to organic chemistry, bridging the gap between living and non-living. This understanding led to synthetic fertilizers, pesticides and pharmaceuticals. Gregor Mendel's experiments with pea plants laid the foundation for modern genetics. He discovered that traits are passed down in predictable ratios, governed by genes. Mendel proposed the laws of segregation and independent assortment. Louis Pasteur revolutionized our understanding of disease with germ theory. He developed pasteurization, improving food preservation and public health. Pasteur's work led to vaccines for anthrax and rabies. The discovery of penicillin by Alexander Fleming revolutionized medicine. Howard Florey and Ernst Chain made mass production possible. Penicillin marked the beginning of the antibiotic era. In 1953, Watson and Crick unveiled the structure of DNA, revolutionizing biology. The double helix revealed how genetic information is stored and replicated. This discovery set the stage for modern biotechnology. The 1970s saw the rise of recombinant DNA technology. Scientists used restriction enzymes and DNA ligase to create GMOs. Genentech produced human insulin in bacteria, transforming diabetes treatment. The Human Genome Project aimed to sequence the entire human genome. Completed in 2003, it revealed around 20,000, 25,000 genes. The HGP paved the way for personalized medicine.
CRISPR-Cas9, a revolutionary gene editing tool, emerged in 2012. It allows precise DNA editing, transforming biotechnology. CRISPR is used in disease therapy, crop engineering and more. Biotechnology has revolutionized medicine offering novel treatments. Gene therapy and targeted cancer therapies are now realities. Diagnostic tools and vaccines have transformed healthcare. Biotechnology enhances food production and sustainability. GM crops increase yields and reduce pesticide use. Biofertilizers and biopesticides offer eco-friendly alternatives. Biotechnology addresses environmental challenges. Bioremediation cleans up pollution and biofuels offer renewable energy. Bioplastics reduce plastic waste, promoting sustainability. Biotechnology raises ethical dilemmas from gene editing to GMOs. Open dialogue and ethical principles are crucial for responsible development. The future depends on navigating these complexities wisely. As we conclude our exploration of biotechnology from its ancient roots to its modern marvels, we stand at the cusp of a new era, a time of unprecedented opportunity and profound responsibility. The story of biotechnology like an unfinished symphony is still being written, its melodies echoing the aspirations, anxieties and ethical dilemmas of our time. From the rudimentary yet ingenious practices of our ancestors to the awe-inspiring power of gene editing, we have witnessed humanity's enduring quest to understand, manipulate and ultimately harmonize with the intricate symphony of life. Biotechnology's future rests on all of us, not just scientists and policymakers. Engage in open dialogues, bridging the gap between labs and the public. Education is paramount. Empower ourselves with knowledge to understand biotechnology's complexities. Foster scientific literacy and evidence-based decision-making. Our choices today shape biotechnology's future. Will gene editing eradicate diseases or create inequality? Will GMOs feed the planet or concentrate power? Biotechnology's future is woven by our choices and values. Let us proceed with wisdom and responsibility.